Hi, I'm Ed from Selden. Let's talk about ML Server. First, what is ML Server? Well, in short, ML Server takes your machine learning models and serves them through both a REST and gRPC interface. Out of the box, you can serve scikit-learn, XGBoost, MLib, LightGBM, Tempo, and MLflow models. But ML Server also allows you to write custom runtimes, which can include your own logic for serving any Python-based model. Let's take a look at some of the cool features that ML Server offers. The capability to run multiple inference workers on a single server. Requests are passed to separately running processes, allowing you to do inference in parallel and maximize the usage of cores on your server. Multi-model serving, which allows you to run multiple models on the same server. These might be different versions of the same model or different models entirely. Models get their own route so that you can easily direct traffic to the relevant model on your server. Support for adaptive batching, a technique that can group incoming requests together, perform predictions on the batch, and then separate the batch again to send responses. Using adaptive batching can help maximize resource usage and minimize the overheads incurred during inference. ML Server also supports the widely adopted V2 inference protocol, and through frameworks like Selden Core and KServe, who use ML Server as a runtime, can be deployed and scaled up on Kubernetes. Installation is as simple as pip install ML Server. Once you've done that, take a look at some of the examples in the docs to help you get started. 